Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have Ikario I Chicago with 1,437 rating versus Jerome904 with 1,260 rating, so it's going to be another high-rated DB video, and with that being said, let's hop right in, and we are going to go ahead and see Jerome win the rock, paper, scissors, shoot, and they will decide to go first, 40 versus 40, gotta love to see it, opening hands, we have Nib, Evenly, Aura, uh, Radian, and then Abominal, Unchained, Soul. So we have Unchained, and then they have Imperm, Extravagance, Shifter, Eagle, Imperm. Okay, so we are going to have Flounderies versus Unchained. Uh, they have Evenly plus Nib. Not the greatest cards against Flounderies. They're going to go Activate Pot of Prosperity, go Banish, Chain Shifter, and then draw two. You know, the standard. Uh, activate a Pot card, and then Chain Shifter, and then they draw Prosperity, Imperm. Wow, that hand sucks. Wow. That hand is not good. Yup, they drew Prosperity, they can't activate it. That's also banished. Um, they're going to set Triple Imperm Pass. I guess because you kind of want to have some... Nah, I'm just holding all these to be honest. Yeah, I think I just hold all these in hand. Because you could set all three. Um, and it makes it live for next turn. If they like summon a monster during your turn that you need to interrupt. But even then, isn't it just set, like, I don't, I don't know, I don't, I don't like the set triple M for a strategy, and it just happens to get punished here. Um, activate Pot of Prosperity to go Banish, Banish 3, look at the top 3, they're going to grab the Shavara there, and then put the Sarama and Prosperity back to the bottom. Okay, normal summon out, Aura, activate Shavara effect, pop special, and then Aura effect, and they're going to activate the Abominal Unchained Soul. So special summon, bring out the Shayama from deck, and then Abominal Unchained Soul to try to pop the Imperm. They're going to chain Imperm. Okay, uh, probably should just target the Shayama. Yep, yeah, go ahead and target that. And then Imperm gets popped. Uh, they're going to go for the DDD now, and then pass. Alright, cool. So the DDD does nothing against us. We are playing Flounderies. Draw Adventure, nice, yep, and now we can just play through this easy. Uh, activate Pot of Prosperity, go Banish 6, look at the top 6, and then that's going to reveal Token, Map, Dreaming Town, grabs the map, put the other cards back to the bottom of the deck now. So now we have Map, Eagle, Adventure, our opponent has 0 interruptions. Activate Map, uh, Map Effect, reveal Eagle, go Banish Robin, summon out Eagle, Eagle 1, Robin 2, uh, so grab back Robin, then go grab Empen from the deck, normal summon out Robin, and then effect, go search, uh, it's going to grab Ostrich, and then tribute, bring out Empen, they do have Shivara and Shayama underneath this, and those both do something in the grave, I guess this also does something in the grave, um, so they have to watch out for that, add back Eagle, and then Empen, go search for Unexplored Winds, Normal Omni um, the Ostrich, Ostrich Effect, Banish Prosperity, then they're going to activate Adventure. Wait, weren't they supposed to normal out their Eaglin? Or am I wrong? Activate Unexplored Winds, Tribute, Bring Out, okay, this works too, yeah. Uh, tribute Over, then they're going to bring out... And then they're going to go Empen 1, Shivara 2. So they will set... Oh yeah, they also get their Ostrich effect that they forgot to activate. But looks like their opponent's fine with it. Okay, so they set Escape. They're going to grab Ostrich back and then go search out for Dreaming Town. Battle phase, attack, and then Empen effect, banish. I said read my cards. Okay. Oh, they're saying read my cards. Like, you should read my cards, because you're not supposed to attack that. Okay, okay. I mean, I agree. I don't think you are supposed to attack that, probably, because that... I mean, it's tough, because Escape's gonna pop Dreaming Town anyways. So Dreaming Town's just not surviving. This is just... It's not happening. It's not. End phase, they're gonna go activate, Abominal, Unchained, Soul to Special, Effect, Discard to Pop... Said, um, you're supposed to special him right after he got sent, not during the end phase. Yeah, if you read it, it says once per turn during the end phase. Yep, and that's really all I gotta read. Yep, so go ahead, pop the Dreaming Town, pass, draw, 
uh, Rekia, but it didn't, literally didn't matter because the escape was popping this no matter what. Okay, um, now Shayama to pop, escape, summon out Shayama, and then escape effect to go summon. That's going to bring out Aura from the deck. You know what deck Flounderies really beats? Marincess. I, I don't know how Marincess is supposed to beat this deck once this deck is even semi-set up. Empen is a whole floodgate. But Shyama pop Aura to pop their map, and then they're going to get Aura effect to go summon. They said it's lagging, no problem. Speed up, please. Whoa, 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 whoa. You did just say it was lagging, but go ahead, summon out. The Soul of Disaster, Affect the Link, go up in the Soul of Rage. Normal summon out the Rekia. And then Rekia Effect to pop. Oh, they're calling Judge. I wonder how long they are actually taking. Let's find out. So they said Speed Up, please. Summon from deck. And then... Okay, declared the effect. Link up. They normal summon, they said okay. Now 40 seconds later, they said go... And then, alright, so they called Judge for slow play. Um, I'm confused what just happened. Um, oh, okay. Yeah, they went Rakia effect, destroy itself, activate its effect. But, um, that's not going to work. Because if it's destroyed by a card effect, except a, you know, except for a copy of itself. So you can't destroy itself to go summon. Um, and the opponent did not catch that. So that's unfortunate for them, because now they get to bring out Sarama, and then that's going to be able to go ahead and go for escape, Sarama effect, set escape, and then pop Sarama, trying to activate Sarama effect to go summon. Oh my gosh, this beeping's going to kill me! I can't handle it, it's just non-stop beep, 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 beep. Oh my goodness, and it's not going to go away, I hate this. But they're going to bring out Shivara, and then they're going to go ahead and link off in the Yama, and then activate the effects here. So Shavara 1, Link 2. They're going to go ahead and grab out Shavara. You know what? Honestly, I'm going to pause this and wait. Alright, back at it. Part 2 of the same video, like 2 hours later. But alright, they're going to go ahead and set Chamber directly from deck off the Shavara. Okay, so go ahead and set that. The Yama was able to go ahead and grab Shavara out from the deck there. Now they are going to use the Yama plus Solar Rage to go up into the Abomination. End phase Abomination. Pop the Unexplored Winds. Now we do have like a special summon. Pop, pop. Our opponent does have Flounderies Engine rolling though. They draw Robin. Uh, just straight off the top, normal summons that Robin. Okay. They're going to go Robin 1, Ostrich 2. Grab back Ostrich, go search out Toucan, and then Normal Summon Ostrich, Ostrich Effect. Um, they're going to go ahead, they're going to target Empen. Okay, then in response, they're going to Chain Escape to pop and pop, and that goes back to the bottom of the deck since it was summoned off its own effect last turn. Um, okay, well I guess not last turn, but you know, the turn before. Then they're going to get their effects. Okay, so they're going to go Toucan... One, Ostrich, two. Yeah, two can try to grab back. Ostrich grab back. Um, yeah, they said question mark, said hi. How can I help you use Ostrich this turn? My opponent slow playing and stopping all my plays. In my turn, I agree, play a little slow, but now my opponent, <clears throat> no declare correctly. This affects targets and etc. Can you be more specific? He doesn't know what he's saying. My opponent literally taken forever to make one play on my turn and his turn. Uh, okay, so the judge paused again. It said, sorry, I say my opponent. No say target Stree and now try to activate Stree twice. You mean the effect to return the hand? Yes, it was used this turn. And no say target two can two. Yeah, Ostrich, or, yeah, Ostrich was used already. Okay, what's the target of Toucan? And they're going to target Empen. Okay. So they're targeting. They may respond to Toucan. No say target if they want to. Okay. Uh, he don't say, or he don't, but okay. Um, use anything. Abomination and Yama. So they're going to pop Robin. Bring out Solar Rage. Then they could pop something, but it doesn't look like they want to. Okay, then they're going to grab back Empen, Normal Eagle. Now the judge said, I will look into the slow play now. Then they're going to go Eagle 1, Robin 2, Solar Rage. But it says you can target one special summon monster the opponent controls. 
Set, set sorry, can't special summon judge. This guy's using an effect and can't even use it. Okay, well, to be fair, they caught that one themselves. So, like, I don't know. Uh, I said, I don't know how many times you're going to stop me from playing. They're going to go search for Mega Monarch. Okay, tribute summon. Alright, I guess, yeah, they get to grab back Robin. Yeah, okay. Go for Empin. Empin 1, Eagle 2. Okay, honestly, I don't remember what birds were used. There was so much arguing going on while playing. I think we've used Ostrich, Robin, Eagle, and we haven't used Toucan. Yeah, we definitely haven't used that one, because that was grabbed off Robin. We added back all the other ones, though. Okay. Go grab Unexplored Winds. Place multiple. That's good here. Um, they said, Sec, did you use the effect of Riki last turn to destroy itself? Yes. Then you used the effect of Summon from Deck. Yes. Can't, right? Uh, they said, if this card on the field is destroyed by card effect except by, yep, they said you cannot, so they just submit the feet, said sorry, learn deck, well that fixes that, I guess, have a nice day, both of you, cheating at it, most, shake my head, imagine if you was not here, he wouldn't say anything about that move, true, and all honestly, Jerome904, that is something you could have pointed out yourself as well, by reading the cards, just learn, play deck. I mean, when someone take 20 minute up play, I get upset and trying to proceed to me playing. Three minutes for side decking, have a nice day. Said, okay, continue talking. Sheesh. All right, on to the next game, though. We're going to see Unchained the side to go second. We got Prison, Aura, Abominable Unchained Soul, Escape, and Gamma Seal. They have Ostrich, Called By, Harpies, Mega Monarch, and Unexplored Winds. So the classic, uh, not great hand. For Flounderies. Um, they probably just put back Mega Monarch, right? No, they put back there too. I guess you kind of have to. Because even like Map Ostrich. I mean, Map Ostrich is good. But it's like, I don't even know. It's a little bit awkward. But yeah, that's the punish. Is like, you draw into Adventure. You don't have anything to work with it. But they just submit the feet there. Sure. Going on to game three now. We're going to go ahead and see Jerome go first. We'll try again. We got Evenly, Escape, Abominable, Chamber, Ash, Prosperity. They have Toucan, Dreaming Town, Robin, Imperm, Adventure. So activate Adventure, Banish Toucan, Chain Ash Blossom, Main Phase, Robin 1, Toucan 2. So they're going to go ahead, grab back Toucan, and then go search out for Eagle. Yep. And then Normal Summon out Eagle, Eagle Effect, grab Apex Avion. And then we're going to tribute someone for Apex Avion. Because we already have Dreaming Town. So we're not going to go for Empen. Just set up a negate. Then we have Imperm, Dreaming Town. Uh, they draw Shayama. Okay. So they're going to go Battle Phase. End of Battle Phase. Evenly. Chain Apex Avion. Uh, even if they have another Evenly. Honestly, another Evenly is fine. Because that's literally just activating MST on Imperm. Then go Main Phase 2. Activate Pot of Prosperity. Banish 6. Looking at those six, he's super polys in their deck. And then that hits. Uh, escape, Chamber, which we already have both of those. Prosperity, already have that. So there's Prison, Shavara, and Sarama. So they're going to grab back the Shavara there. Yeah, Sarama doesn't really do anything uh, without anything in the graveyard. You kind of need to be able to pop these. This doesn't do anything in the hand, sadly. Um, now they're going to go ahead and set Chamber, activate Shivara to pop, special summon, and then Chamber effect to go special. They're going to change Dreaming Town to summon out Eagle. They're going to bring out the Abominable Unchained Soul. Alright, uh, then Abominable Unchained Soul 1, Eagle 2, and then they're going to go... Well, I guess you may as well just go Imperm 3, right? Yeah, Imperm 3 on that, shut that down. And then they're going to go ahead, search out Empin, Normal Summon Toucan, and then Effects. Wait, I'm confused. So did we, we only did Eagle last chain. I just realized that. We didn't even chain block it. I guess, yeah, I don't know. It's a little bit weird. Okay. Then they're going to Tribute, bring out Empin. Like, they would have been sick if they got hit with, like, an Ash Blossom or something. Empin 1, Dreaming Town 2, Eagle 3, grab back Eagle, banish, set their field, go search out for adventure, and then normal Robin, Robin effect to go search, 
And then Robin's gonna go search out for Ostrich. Okay. Uh, Ostrich on the Shyama. Seems like that is real tough. Ostrich 1, Toucan 2, Banish Shyama. Uh, add back Toucan, then go for Apex Avion. They're gonna set escape. I was gonna say it doesn't even do anything. They admit the feet, they said bomb. Sheesh! Alright, alright, alright. Hey, there was the Ash. Said all that cheating and still lost. Crazy how y'all DB players be cheating. 1400 rating, shake my head. And then they leave. Okay. Well, seeing how long the match was. It's about 50 minutes long. Yeah, it is a pretty long game. Um, but they also had a judge call, so judge call can take a little bit. You know, it was like a 10 minute judge call. But, yeah, I mean, that's it for the match. It wasn't like, I don't know, I mean, there was like some toxic and stuff there. I mean, there was also, like, they were saying that they were cheating. I mean, yeah, they were definitely making plays that they should not have been able to make. Like the Rikio pop itself, the Sarama pop itself. You know, if those plays were legal, these cards would be so much better. Those plays are not legal. And, yep, with all that being said, the DB Grinder signing off. Peace, have a nice day, stay safe.